Hey there YouTube, this is SGM4306 back with another video. I've been working on the uh, arcade project a little bit more and this is it right here. I have the uh, bezel, the LCD mounted. Um, it's just kind of floating in there right now. I'm going to attach it better. I disconnected the um, RGB uh, LEDs just for this test since I'm just running it off of this little battery bank here. But I have some of the buttons wired up enough to demonstrate. And if you can see, I have the IR sensor for the LCD, so that'll be mounted uh, near the speakers so you can use the remote if you ever need to. I have everything uh, screwed and mounted using uh, standoffs to the back here, and wiring's an absolute mess that needs to be fixed. But this is just a short demonstration. So let me just get this guy up and running. Okay, and for the demonstration... Uh, I just have, <laughs> I don't have any wall warts within easy reach, so I'm just using this uh, laptop lithium battery to power the screen. Just going to hold the wires on with one hand. And there we go. So the uh, screen popped back on. And let me get you a close up on that. Uh, the joystick works. I don't believe any of the other buttons. I didn't wire them up right. Uh, well, I didn't wire them up at all, actually. So only the joystick I have wired right now. But you can see everything scrolls through. It all works. And that screen looks really nice, actually. I really like that with the uh, the fake um, bezel. I have an LED for this uh, battery indicator that I will be um, lighting up. So that'll actually be the power indicator as well. So it'll work. Pretty much like a giant Game Boy, but with uh, arcade controls. So yeah, that's all going to be wired and ready to go. Um, I ordered some shorter connectors for the, um, the HDMI, power, that kind of stuff. So I need to do a lot of wiring. I ordered another power supply because the one that I originally wanted to use actually won't be that great, unfortunately. But yeah, you can see everything scrolls through and this is going to be freaking awesome. <laughs> I mean, just look at that. Let me just get this out of the way. Yep. And I've already shown you the sides are already painted and it's pretty much ready to go. Um, just kind of small things and I have to mount a lot of it like securely. I have to actually figure out how I'm going to fit the front face plate in but make it so it's easily removable in case I need to service, etc, etc. But yeah, you can see it's all coming together and it is pretty sweet. So... You know, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. This was just a quick progress update, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.